I hope you know that I'm going to call balls and strikes. I've had some disagreements with the takes from Ben Shapiro. He's obviously a brilliant mind, don't get me wrong, but that doesn't mean your takes can't be cringe. But I'm going to give him and Tom McDonald some credit here. Uh, why was this joint so fire right here? I'm only going to play like maybe three-fourths of his verse. This is, uh, undeniably, this is dope to me. Let's just keep it real facts. Don't care how you feel, man. If you want my pronouns, I'm the man. I'm the man who don't respect Let's look at the stats. I've got the facts. My money like lives with my pockets are fat. Homie, I'm epic. Don't be a whap. Dog, it's a yarmulke. Homie, no cap. Look at the graphs. Look at my charts. You're blowing money on strippers and cars. You go into prison. I'm on television. Dogs, no one knows who you are. Keep hating on me on the internet. My comment section all woke Karens. And I make racks off compound interest. Y'all live with me. That's it. And then I go support Tom McDonald if you want to hear more of that. That, But it got kind of whack after that. I, have, I haven't even listened to the verse. I just clipped about 30 seconds of it. And I've been playing that clip. I probably listened to that clip 20 plus times probably. And uh, I just, I, the end of it, the cadence got a little kind of weird for me. But that part of it, the lyrics, he, the lyrics are hilarious. And I like how he's just the, the sweater idea with the facts don't care about your feelings. That's what everybody knows him for. And, and him just being kind of, he got the hoodie up. He went with the hoodie up and the hands in the pocket. That was dope. That was dope. He said, let's look at the stats. I've got the facts. My money like Lizzo, my pockets are fat. See, that's an old school hip hop thing where it's, that's an old school hip hop. Everybody, it's like a classic C major chord in music. I mean, it's just standard to talk about how much money you have, but then you throw it on top of the Jewish stereotype and him going straight at it, dope. It's, it was very important for him to have a likable moment. This was that. Homie, I'm epic. Don't be a WAP. <laughs> Making fun of the joint, the Nikki joint, or the, it's the Cardi B joint. Uh, that's funny. Dog, it's a yarmulke. Homie, no cap. Look at that. This is just dope. Look at the graphs. Look at my charts. You're blowing money on strippers and cars. You're going to prison. I'm on television. Dog, no one knows who you are. So there's a lot of people coming at them, and that's what rap is about. You you would always make up people to be coming at you, but this in this case, everybody's, including myself, has come at him. My comment section are woke Karens. I make racks off compound interest. So he went straight at it. And here's the end that I didn't put in there. Y'all, live with your parents. Nikki, take some notes. I just did this for fun. All my people download this. Let's get a billboard number one. So that part was whack. But all the way up to the, um, I make racks of compound interest. Y'all live with your parents. That was fire. And I want another joint, man. They, these two need to do an album together, man. Like Adam Calhoun. It's very smart stuff. Daily Wire's dope. I still like Daily Wire. It's hard for me not to like them. I got beef with Ben Shapiro. Uh, he's obviously the pro-Israel dude. But this was a good moment. This is a good moment. Number one rapper right now in the game, Ben Shapiro. Check it. Middle MAGA.